the good, very good question. I lost my faith by not getting answers to questions. I, uh, uh, every religious leader has never answered questions like, okay, man has free will, right? What did that have to do with Katrina? If God is omnipotent, could he have prevented the monsoon? So I lost my faith uh, right at the bottom of my, bar, my bar mitzvah. I started asking rabbis questions because they encouraged me to ask questions. Then I would ask questions of really, I, I interviewed, except for the Pope, every major religious leader, head of the Russian Orthodox Church, head of the Mormon, Mormon Church, um, Catholic bishops, James Pike, the Episcopal Bishop, and there's one that they never have an answer, and the same answer is, we don't question the ways of the Lord, or the Lord has a plan. Do you believe that some mystical figure up there has a plan for you, and the plan might be to blow you away in a hurricane? The and they front on God. They just don't believe God anymore. So um, this message is designed to help people. I'm telling you the punishment of those that don't believe God anymore. My friend, if you're watching this video, it glory to God and you want to know what are the punishment of people that does not believe God anymore. The Bible say, my friend, he that believe and baptize shall be saved. He that believe it not shall be damned. So if you are an unbeliever, if all of a sudden you take your faith away from God, you don't believe God anymore. Yes, you don't believe God anymore. The Bible say, my friend, without faith, it's impossible to please God. He that come unto God must first believe that he's a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. And the Bible say, glory to God, that, hallelujah, if you don't believe that I am he, you're going to die in your sin. So a person that does not believe God anymore, you will be punished with death. And the death I'm talking about, my friend, is a second death. Let me give you a prime example. Can I give you a prime example? It's like a dog bite his master. A dog turn, turn against his master. The master gonna put that dog to sleep. Hey, glory to God. So, my friend, imagine you are a believer and all of a sudden you stop believing God. You turn your back on God. You say, God don't exist anymore. God, you say, God is a fairy tale. You say, God is a, is a spaghetti man. Hey, glory to God. You say, God is like Santa Claus. You say, God is like a fair, fruit fairy. You turn your back on God. And you expect to go to heaven? <laughs> you expect the glory to God to be with God? Why would you want to go to heaven when you don't believe in God? Why would you want God to, to go to God to be with you if you won't be with God? God not going to force his love upon somebody that does not believe in him. And I tell people, my friend, I don't care if you're an atheist. I don't care if you're agnostic. I don't care if go to God, you're a Satanist, you're a witch, my friend, or you're a pagan. If you don't believe in God, you, you are punishing yourself and you can get punished and the punish is a second death. The Bible say, my friend, the unbelievers, hey, go to God to have their part in a lake of fire. Revelation 21 verse 8. Read it for yourself, my friend. What if I don't believe God anymore? We got a lot of people, my friend. Look at, look at Larry King. Larry King died a couple of days ago, and he said he don't believe in God anymore. And the reason why he say he don't believe in God because he say the, the Sawami, the Sawani, whatever happened, they go to God in Louisiana. He say, go to God. God didn't save those people, but God let those people die in the hallelujah, in a hurricane. And so he stopped believing that God don't exist anymore in his book. So he turned his back on God.
my friend, you turn your back on God. God, God, hallelujah, God gonna turn back on you. Because why would God force his love upon you? You don't believe in God no more. So a message designed to help somebody that God is real. If you don't believe that God is real, my friend, look in the Bible. The Bible says that heaven declare the glory of God. God is not the God of the dead. God is of the living. God is the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Israel. Hey, glory to God. And the reason why God is a God of the living, because my friend, the Bible talk about this, this one man, this, this woman have seven husbands. And they say, if the woman die, who husband uh, it going to be? Hey, glory to God. And the Bible said, God is the God of the living. Y'all do err the scripture, knowing that I'm God of the living, not God of the dead. That's what y'all think. Y'all think God is dead. Hey, glory. Y'all think God's on vacation. Y'all think God, my friend, has forgotten the world. But my friend, God is still here. In him we live and move and have our being. Do you remember, do you remember a story? Hey, glory to God, help me, Holy Ghost. You remember a story with Elijah and the Baal and prophets? Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. Elijah told the Baal and prophet, I want you to go first. Call on Balaam. Call on Balaam. And the Bible says, hey, glory to God, they call on Balaam, and Balaam didn't answer. And hallelujah, Elijah was mocking them, saying, uh, hallelujah, Balaam must be on vacation. Cry louder, cry louder, cry louder. And the more they cry louder, they'll cut themselves with a latchet, my friend. Hallelujah. And, and Balaam didn't answer. You know why? Balaam have eyes and can't see. Mouth and can't talk. Ears and can't hear. Hand and can't feel. Feet and can't walk. Nose and can't smell, but our God, my friend, hey, glory to God, hallelujah. Elijah said, Get out of the way now. I want you to put three thongs of water on the altar, hallelujah. And I'm going to call on the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, and the God of Israel, and the God of answer by fire. That's the God that I serve, hallelujah, glory to God. And guess what? The God answered, my friend. Hallelujah, God, the God answered by fire. He consumed the sacrifice that was on the altar. I'm talking about what's in the Bible, my friend. The God of the universe is alive. And the reason why, glory to God, y'all want, want God because y'all want, want to see God to believe it. But that's not faith, my friend. Faith, the Bible says, my friend, blessed are those that have not seen me but yet believe. Thomas, Thomas, Thomas was not there when Jesus Christ came and go to God. And Thomas, my friend, said, unless I see the print in his, his hand and the a, and a, and a spirit in his side, I will not believe. And the Bible said Jesus Christ came, hallelujah, and told him, hallelujah, come here, Thomas, come here. He said, reach hit of thy hand and touch my side. Reach into my hand and touch my hand. Uh, but the Bible says, blessed are those that have not seen me, huh, but yet believe. What I'm saying to you is watching my video on a sunny, sunny afternoon, sunny evening, my friend. What if I don't believe God anymore? Punishment, my friend. Death. Doom. Damn. Destruction to you because you don't believe God anymore. God ain't no play toy. Hallelujah, God, hallelujah. The God that made you woke you up this morning, start you on your way. The God that gives the breath of life in your body, and you will turn your back. You're like a dog. Hallelujah, turn their back on their maker. Turn their back on their master. Turn their back on the one that fed them when he was hungry. And the master of that dog, carry the dog to the vet and tell the vet, kill this dog. This dog not fit to live. Because a dog turn, his, turn on the master that fed him. Time to poop. Hey, glory to God. I fed you, dog. And your dog, you turn your back on me. Just like human being, my friend. Y'all want God to come down here and hold your hands. You want God to come down here so y'all can feel God. Hey, glory to God. Moses saw the backside of God. Because God, it's, it's like how the sun looking. You see how the sun is in my face? Hey, glory to God. That's how, if you see God, you're going to die. Because God is reigning, is so powerful. Our eyes can't behold the, the, the magnificence of plenness of God. So what happens if I don't believe? You're going to be damned. You're going to be doomed. You're going to have destruction. You're going to end up in a lake of fire because you don't believe the one that creates you. 
you're gonna believe the one that woke you up this morning, the one that brought to God, form you from the dust of the girl, uh, of the earth and breathe unto you the breath of life. What if I don't believe God uh, anymore? I was talking to this young lady, it go to God, hallelujah. And I was witnessing to her. Hey, glory to God. All of a sudden, she, she say that I, I got a mental illness because, hey, glory to God, I witnessed to her about Jesus because Jesus don't exist anymore. Jesus is a fairy tale. Hey, glory to God. <laughs> Hallelujah, glory to God. Hear me? She said, Jesus is a fairy tale. I come and tell you, my friend, the fairy is on you and the tale is on you because one day we're all going to stand before God the Bible says it's a point a man wants to die, then the judgment. We're going to be judged, every one of us. Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. We're going to stand before the living God. The Bible says in Revelation that they're going to tell the stone fall on us. Hey, glory to God. Hide us from him that sit up on the throne. You know why? Because God was so powerful. The Bible says, every eye shall see him, even that pierce him on the side. So if you're watching this video, my friend, you better believe God. Hey, glory to God. If you don't believe God, my friend, you know, her punishment, anguish, and pain. Hey, glory to God. Look at, look at, look at the, all the children, the children of Israel that came out of Egypt. Those men that turned their back on God. Hallelujah. They, 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 they told Aaron, build us a calf because we all know what happened to this man called Moses. And the Bible say they, 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 they told him, uh, 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 Aaron, glory to God, to build a calf. Aaron say, take off your earrings and I want to build me a calf of gold that will brought us from Egypt. Oh, glory to God. That's what people nowadays, my friend, we think idols, glory to God, people making idols of themselves. What do you think they have selfie, my friend? What do you think everything, everything about themselves? Because they think they are God. They think they don't need the God. Hey, glory to God. I'm God. Hey, glory to God. They got, that's what a faith movement say. They are God. You're not God. You can't be God. You can't make nothing. You can't speak to things that exist. You can't be God. But the faith movement, you talk about Crefford Dollar, hey, glory to God, T.D. Jakes, hallelujah, Benny Hinn, and whole oh, glory to God, and Paula White, hallelujah, all the Mark, uh, Marcus Roger, all those people, my friend, glory to God, they believe that they can be God. But the Bible says you're going you gonna, to you gonna die like mortal men. What if, what happened if I don't believe God anymore? Punishment, my friend. You're going to die. You're going to be damned. Hey, glory to God. I'm not cursing. I'm just saying what the Bible says. Mark 16, verse 16. He that believeth and baptized shall be saved. He that believeth not shall be damned. Damnation. Come on, though, that the Bible says, fool has said in his heart, there is no God. And it said it two times in Psalm 14 and Psalm 53. The fool, you are a fool, my friend. You are stupid. The word fool means stupid. The stupid has said in his heart, there ain't no God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Help me, Holy Ghost. I'm trying to help somebody out there right now. If you don't believe in God, look at young children. Young children don't believe in God. It's all about electronic. The, the electronic become their God. Series, oh, hallelujah, hallelujah, now become a God. Series don't know more than God. God know more than, than Google, my friend. It ain't no comparison. Hallelujah. Amen. Come on now. Hallelujah. Siri, hallelujah. Oh, whatever, whatever that become a lady name. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Turn the lights on for you. Turn the music on for you. Hallelujah. hallelujah. Do all the things. They, 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 God know more than they are. God know more than Google. Why say God know more than Google? Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Amen. So, what if I don't believe God anymore? You damn. Yes, you can be damned. Eternal damn nation. What that mean? That mean that they no turning back. You going to hell. You going to lick a fire. You going to be burned for eternity. Why? Because you don't believe God anymore. There are people go they lost their loved one and they blame it on God. Huh. Go the the cat died and the dog died and they blame it on God. Their husband died, their wife died, they blame it on God. They lost their job, they blame it on God. The, the old house, glory to God, burnt down, they blame it on God. The, the, the child died, they blame it on God. Hey, glory to God, hallelujah. Look at Job, Job lost everything. Job lost his family, 
Job lost his finance. Hey, glory to God. Even Job lost his wife. His wife said, curse God and die. Hey, glory to God. Job said, he's like a foolish woman. You said like a foolish woman. Job rebuked his wife. Said, you said like a foolish woman. Job said, the Lord give it and the Lord take it away. Blessed be the name of the Lord. What if? What if I don't believe God anymore? You are damned. I say that you are damned. Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My friend, God is too good for me to, to deny him. Hey, glory to God. What? God brought me from Jamaica? God brought me when my mother and father turned their back on me? Hallelujah. Oh, my, oh, my sin brother don't disown me? You think I'm going to turn my back on God? No way. God, God be my bread when I'm hungry. God be my water when I'm thirsty. God, if I say mother and father take you, the Lord will take you up. God been too good to me. That's why I tell people, my friend, if you want to hear the truth, hallelujah, stay on YouTube, like, journey, go to God. If you want to hear a lie, you're not going to hear from here because God has been too good to me. Hallelujah, glory to God, hallelujah. He's better, he's better, my friend, than God called. He's better than all state insurance. He's better than camel soup, mm, 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 good. I'm talking about what if I don't believe God anymore, you are stupid. Because the Bible said, a fool has said in his heart, there is no God. When God, when Paul, hallelujah, and in, in, in Acts, the 17 chapter, when Paul was going to Athens, and it's an inscription to the unknown God whom you ignorantly worship, him I declare unto you. Not too superstitious. Hey man, y'all too superstitious. Hey, glory to God. Why if I don't believe in God anymore?